You've probably heard the term relay tossed around in countless electrical and electronic discussions. It's a versatile component capable of controlling hefty loads with tiny signals. But here's the burning question, is it always the right choice? Let's face it, sometimes a relay is overkill. It's like using a sledgehammer to crack a nut. So, when exactly should you ditch the relay and explore alternatives? That's what we're about to uncover. First, let's clarify what a relay is. It's essentially an electrically operated switch. A small current activates a coil, which in turn, mechanically operates a set of contacts. These contacts can then handle much larger currents. Simple, right? But it's this mechanical operation that introduces potential drawbacks. Drawbacks of relays. Speed, relays are relatively slow. The mechanical movement of the contacts takes time. While this might be negligible for most applications, it can be a deal breaker in high speed systems. Reliability, moving parts mean potential wear and tear. Over time, relays can become unreliable. Noise, the mechanical clicking of a relay can generate electrical noise, which can interfere with sensitive circuits. Power consumption, while the relay itself might consume low power, the coil requires current to operate, which can add up in battery powered systems. Size and cost, relays are physical components, taking up space and adding to the overall cost of a project. When to consider alternatives? Now, let's dive into specific scenarios where you might want to rethink using a relay. Low power applications. If you're dealing with tiny currents, a transistor might be a better choice. They're faster, quieter, and consume less power. MOSFETs are particularly popular for this purpose. High-speed applications. Relays simply can't keep up with the speed demands of modern electronics. Solid-state relays, SSRs, or transistors are the way to go. SSRs combine the best of both worlds, solid-state reliability with the ability to handle high currents. Noise-sensitive circuits. Any electrical noise can wreak havoc on sensitive circuits. Relays are notorious noise generators. Opt for solid-state alternatives like transistors or optocouplers. Long life expectancy. If your device needs to last for years without maintenance, relays might not be the most reliable option. Solid-state components generally have longer lifespans. Size and weight constraints. Relays are physical components that take up space. If you're building a compact device, transistors or integrated circuits might be better suited. Alternatives to relays. Transistors, these are the workhorses of electronic circuits. They can amplify signals or act as switches. For low power applications, bipolar junction transistors, BJTs, are common. For higher power, MOSFETs are preferred. Solid state relays, SSRs, these combine the speed and reliability of solid state components with the current handling capabilities of relays. They're ideal for applications that demand both high speed and high power. Opticouplers, these devices use light to transfer signals, providing electrical isolation. They're excellent for preventing noise and protecting sensitive circuits. Integrated circuits, ICs, many ICs incorporate switching capabilities. For example, motor driver ICs can control high current loads without the need for external relays. Choosing the right component. Selecting the right component depends on several factors. The load you need to control, voltage, current. Required switching speed. Power consumption. Environmental conditions. Cost. Size and weight. It's essential to carefully evaluate these factors to make an informed decision. Conclusion. While relays are versatile components, they're not always the best choice. Understanding their limitations and exploring alternatives can lead to more efficient, reliable, and cost-effective designs. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.